This is one two inch conical strainer having four parts. This is stainless steel screen or wear mesh of 20 mesh or 40 mesh as per process requirement. And this wear mesh is fixed over 2 mm thick stainless steel perforated sheet. This is conical ring and this is handle. All these items should be of stainless steel. Flow direction is like this. That means at first fluid is screened or filtered by stainless steel wear mesh supported by perforated plate. Then the fluid flows through the holes of perforated sheet. This 2 inch conical strainer is correct. Only one small defect is there. The defect is the conical ring should have serration on both sides for gasket leak tightness because this conical ring will be mounted in between the raised face of two flanges with gaskets. This is one large dia conical strainer. As like 2 inch conical strainer this conical strainer is also having stainless steel wear mesh over stainless steel perforated sheet, conical ring and handle. But additionally, this conical strainer is having stainless steel circular stiffener ring and stainless steel longitudinal stiffener flats welded inside perforated sheet to prevent collapse of the strainer against pressure in clogged condition. Conical strainer having size more than 10 inch should have this type of stiffeners. If stiffeners are not provided inside the perforated sheet, then conical strainer may collapse like this. This conical strainer is correct and perfect. We should not face any problem with this strainer. Now, I will compare few other defective conical strainers with respect to this conical strainer. Left side conical strainer is a large dia defective conical strainer because wear mesh has been provided inside the perforated sheet. So at sight it was used in reverse direction and it was torn off due to debris accumulation. Also, this strainer is not provided with any stiffener as like right side strainer. In this case also, the left side strainer is a large diaconical strainer. Wear mesh is correctly placed over the perforated sheet. But this strainer has not been provided with any stiffener inside the perforated sheet. So, this strainer may collapse against pressure under clogged condition. So, for a conical strainer, we should specify the strainer correctly including requirement of stiffeners for large dia conical strainers. This is one Y type strainer inside which filter element is there consisting SS perforated cylinder and SS wear mesh inside the perforated sheet. Fluid comes inside the strainer like this. Then it is filtered by the screen. Then through perforated sheet fluid comes out to the annular space and goes out from the Y strainer. Now you can see the perforated cylinder and wear mesh inside the perforated sheet. This Y strainer is correct and not having any problem with it. This is one T-type strainer. 
inside the flange T filter element is there. Now you can see the filter element from T strainer outlet side. This is view from branch side from where filter element can be removed in horizontal plane. This is the filter element inside the T strainer. Fluid enters to the filter element from right side of the T like this and after filtration fluid comes out to the other side of the T. Now you can see the filter element consisting of stainless steel frame and stainless steel wear mesh but there is no perforated sheet so wear mesh is not supported. This is filter element of another T strainer where SS frame is there, SS perforated sheet is there and SS wear mesh is there inside the perforated sheet. This T strainer filter element is correct. Now if we compare these two T strainer filter elements, left side filter element is having only SS frame and SS wear mesh. So wear mesh is not supported. But right side filter element is having SS frame which supports perforated sheet and SS wear mesh inside perforated sheet. So wear mesh will not be torn off easily. This is picture of filter element of another T strainer where only SS frame and SS wear mesh is there. Since the wear mesh is not supported by perforated sheet, SS wear mesh torn off after first use. So we have to be very careful while specifying any T strainer so that it will have SS frame SS perforated sheet and SS wear mesh inside the perforated sheet.